of beautiful family, lovers of good things, lovers of important personnel, all over the globe, I bring greetings from a grateful heart. Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening, depending on your time zone. Thank you for your love. Thank you for your support. I just can't thank you enough. So, my colleague people, today of all day, I have a wonderful one to share with you. <laughs> you guys know that earlier this week, a lot of information has been moving up and down. A lot of talk is coming from all angles. A Batman, Zina Dikanu, and his legal team. Not just one high profile uh, media house is that broadcast on this particular issue that Mazi Inab Dikanu is about to reshare for his legal team that Mazi Inab Dikanu is not happy with the present situation that Mazi Inab Dikanu thinking that the, the legal personnel that is representing him they are not working well hereby he decided that he is going to reshare for them that he believed that they is not well represented and he is so disappointed. You know that when this information comes up, according to some other media houses, they said that they, one of the lawyers that visit Mazina Dekano is the one that tell them this, okay? And um, they also make some other information available to the public, say some kind of things from Mazina Dekano and all that. If you look at it very deeply, you are also going to see some atoms of truth from the information because believe me a lawyer that went to visit mazina abdikanu cannot just come up with those things himself is a lawyer and when he speaks about uh, the lawyers he will not also in exclude himself he will also be included because they are the people that are in the front runner for Mazi in Abdikanun. So it happens that this news were making headway everywhere. Even myself, I also talked about it, okay? So right now, uh, Barista Ifa in Asia for just blow hot and he respond to some of the lawyer, E.G. Barista Aloy Ejemako and, and some other lawyers that are working with Barista Aloy Ejemako you guys know that in the beginning, Barrister Aloy Ejemako and Barrister Ifan Ejofo, these are two close pallies. These are people that are working together. Now, what happened that there is a strong conflict between them? As it stands right now, let's not romance the world. We will know that the DOS are for Barrister Ifan Ejofo. Why Mazina Dekanu's family are for barista aloy ejemako that is just the truth that is what we are saying okay and that is what is playing out and today barista if i age of four respond to who it may consign like the barista that go and visit mazina the canoe that brought this information saying that mazina the canoe is not happy come on come think about it you don't expect Mazina the canoe to be happy with the present situation especially now that money scattered everything the little information that should be handled with care they lose guard it and they could not handle the information or they cannot handle the situation that led to the splitting and the doing away of everybody doing their things by their own self especially fighting for the same cause of biafra restoration now the question here now is that Barista Ifa in age of four blew hot and he was so angry, saying that they lied against Mazina the Kanu, that Mazina the Kanu never said anything of such, that Mazina the Kanu so much believed in him and Barista uh, Mike Ezekome. I'm, I'm like, shoo. So does that mean that these are the only two persons that Mazina the Kanu said he still believe up to date the work that they have put in place, that anybody that's just trying to lie against Mazina the Kanu, that is not true, that he still remain the most trusted of Mazina the Kanu and Biafra so much love him, that that person that went to dish out this information is a liar, is the third partner and all that. And, and you know that it's referring to Barista Aloy Ejimako so right now what is your take on it and i have another update here about what is happening right now you can see how these people the grand denier and kept them inside the sack bag and what you are going to see next is going to shock you so 
Let's go. Mazen Nandekano once says that Nigeria will be worse than Somalia. And he once says that Somalia currency will be better than Nigeria currency. That in our own very eyes, Nigeria currency will become tissue paper. Nigerians, come and watch your currency. You are going to watch your currency right now. How it is granted like tissue paper. Mazen Nandekano, I can only say, may God bless your soul. It is well with your soul. Nigerians all over the world, those Nigerians, come and see your currency. How it is being granted like dust, like tissue paper. Mazen Nandekano, now you get this hand. God bless your soul. Hundred bags. They catch them. Hey, who catch them? Ah, 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 ah. They don't. Uh, Taylor, they don't spoil this country. Now Taylor, they take enter. They're going to use back. Come, come on, they will flow down. See, see, I this up. See, see, it's five hundred, you. Men are see, five hundred naira. Men are see. I've only bought this bag, so. See, it's five hundred, you. Hey, give them money. Hey, Oh, my wonderful family of a truth a lot is really going on and the people are passing through a lot of hardship right now because of this naira that someone just grind and threw them away so my community people please you need to share this video and let it go viral thank you so much once again for me to you from here i said bye